Welcome everyone to the sixth video to Christmas. So today we are going to be taking a little detour in our programming. Um, instead of focusing on six specific Christmas related um, topics, we're going to be taking some time to recall some memories we have shared with Maya. Mm -hmm. And the reason we're doing this, uh, many of you may know already, but some may not. We um, recently got some news that she is terminally ill. Yeah. Sorry, folks. <laughs> so we, we just wanted to do six memories of Maya. I am Peter. And I am Kelly. And this is our four-legged companion, Maya. We are a couple from Edmonton, Alberta. And we are here to share some authentic tales of our married life together. As we strive to honor God through the trials and the triumphs. And deepen our relationship with one another along the way. So Maya decided to come join us. She heard us talking about her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So one of the memories I have of Miss Maya is we, we go to Jasper, as some of our other videos have, have shown and stuff, and Maya just loves going to the mountains. Um, one of the reasons, we do a lot of hiking, and Maya loves to go on walks and, and enjoy the mountain, all the different areas, scenery, everything that she just loves to be part of. So um, we've been on quite a few different hikes in Jasper, summertime, wintertime. Maya's a, a huge trooper and she she just goes and goes and goes. Just loves to be part of the, the adventure. And um, one of the times that I remember was um, we were in Jasper during the summertime. I don't remember exactly when, but it was a, a very, very long hike that time. I thought it was maybe two and a half maybe three hours max kind no. of thing <laughs> it was it was a lot more and i was uh, tapping out i was yeah. ready to quit <laughs> peter go get the car yeah. um, <laughs> let's get a ride back somehow i don't know but um meyer was a really good trooper on that and she made it the entire way mm -hmm. and um at the very end of it though we we climb into the car and miss Maya <laughs> goes into the back and she just goes in this position and, and she's just basically out. Out, out cold. <laughs> yeah. Had a good time, but uh, yeah. I think that's the, the time as well when we went back to the hotel. There's little placards that say, do not disturb. And um, I, the one that was there was a, a picture of a puppy on it. And it, it had... The puppy was sleeping and it said... One too many hikes. There you go. Yeah, <laughs> or something like that anyways, for yeah, sure. Yeah, it was cute. And uh, so, good memories, for sure. Yeah, I remember too, when we were uh, there in the winter time, I think it was either in January or March for, for your birthday or anniversary, one of the two. And um, we went around, we went on a hike around a lake and uh -huh. the lake was uh -huh. completely frozen over and Maya just tore off running onto this lake and came yeah. back smiling as big a smile ever <laughs> that I've seen a dog have mm -hmm. and uh, we'll show you we'll show you a clip of that but it was pretty pretty awesome yeah. hike as well yeah Maya Maya just has the feature set on her face that when she's running and whatever she she turns it into a smile while she's running so yeah I don't know if we if that will show in a picture or whatever but it's it's nice nice to see for <laughs> sure so Kind of comical, but pretty good. So another memory we have of traveling with Maya is the time we went to uh, the Oregon coast to visit my mm -hmm. aunt. Mm -hmm. So um, she was certified as an emotional support animal for me. So she got to come with us mm -hmm. on the airplane and sit on my lap, Yeah, which was great um, for me to have her close by. And um, she didn't care for it that much though. She wasn't a... A oh, big no. fan of flying no. <laughs> and the airport it was just overwhelming for her just the amount of people and yeah. not having a clear kind of sidewalk or or curb <laughs> to, to follow um it was it was a little overwhelming for her but she was a trooper for sure and she um it's <laughs> funny they have in the airport they have designated areas to take your dog so they can um 
relieve themselves. Relieve themselves. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. And um, so we took her um, during one of our layovers to one of these areas, and um, it it didn't smell very nice no. but I mean they had a, an area of fake grass and even a fake little hydrant and 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 they tried but um Maya just kind of looked at us in utter don't do it horror <laughs> and said what, what do you expect me to do here <laughs> uh, this is this is not humane Mm -hmm. <laughs> so um, we we ended up finding ways out of the airport and back in and whatnot because yeah. she was she was not doing that <laughs> she was having none of that none of that yeah <laughs> so yeah. and then we eventually arrived um, at my uh, at my aunt's home and we were we were going to be surprising my dad and stepmom mm -hmm. as well because they were coming down a couple days after and didn't know what, that we would be there so on the day that they were arriving we ran downstairs just before they pulled up mm -hmm. and um, hid in the basement. <laughs> but as soon as the doorbell rang, Maya took off running upstairs. <laughs> and I tried to stop her, but she was she was too fast. She's yeah. a little sprinter. Yeah. And uh, she just it gets so excited when people are coming at the door. At the door. So there she was. <clears throat> and uh, we almost got away with it. My, my stepmom was like, oh my goodness, did you get a dog? to my aunt and 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 then my dad piped in that's no dog that's maya <laughs> <laughs> so he he knew right away he knew right away yeah. yeah he recognized her even though they hadn't seen her in i don't know how long but yeah. Yeah. um she's a very memorable little yeah. girl so yeah. she blew our surprise but it but it was all it was good nice. yeah <laughs> and then we um we went to the beach because oh, right. um the your, your aunt is basically right on the beach. Yeah, 10 mm -hmm. minutes from the not, beach. Not even. That's walking distance, basically. Yeah. But um, so we um, packed up, I think, animals, and Miss Maya came, and we were walking down the beach, and we, we walked down the beach for a long time, and Maya was just loving it. She would run. Yeah, yeah. Um, I would actually race Maya down to the beach. <laughs> we're, you'd see it as old guy <laughs> puffing and puffing <laughs> running down the beach Trying and then this little puppy just goes zoom right by and, and right by me yep <laughs> past me no problem and she looked back are you coming are you coming <laughs> and um so it was kind of neat that way but um being on uh, the oregon beach it's, it's pretty windy so her ears are flapping and <laughs> going all over the place and there's little seagulls all around so she's she's very curious and and maybe even you know getting close to chasing but no no way she'll catch a, yeah. a seagull or anything <laughs> like that but she just had a, a great time she right on the beach like that so that was nice to see mm -hmm. yeah so another memory that we have and um you guys might even see pictures already kind of thing but um, um i love riding motorbikes and um introduced Kelly to riding motorbikes which meant that I had to introduce Miss Poppy to riding motorbikes as well too so some of the uh, just quick little trips around town just to get her used to being on the bike the noise and uh, just the openness and the fresh air so um, when I'm riding my motorcycle you could I feel a little head just come up on my shoulder and or on the other shoulder because we got uh, a special backpack for, for puppies, made especially for um, riding on bikes and, and whatever. So she's secured to my back as we're, we're going out and down the road. And so, but in the town, she was just having a great time. We even got her little special doggles that she, she wears so the, the wind doesn't, you know, hurt her eyes too much and, and everything. But um, there's a lot of memories on, on little bike trips here and there. and even a little further out to out of the city we go for a little further of a ride so and then um but she's totally protected mainly from the wind because of the big windshield and on the bike or you know she settles in behind and or whatever like that so she's she just loves it though yeah we we got another care for her as well at yeah. one point yeah. um that sat on the back of the bike so behind my seat and um, she actually could lay down in that one. So yeah. when we had that carrier, she we would go on a um, little bit longer trips, and she'd just yeah. settle in like 
Yeah. Like it was nothing. She would poke her head out and look. Look. What's happening over here? Or, anything? Yeah. <laughs> anything to see? No? All right. Yeah. I'm going back to sleep. <laughs> yeah. Or we'd slow down for a little bit and stop at um, little different areas and we'd all get out and go for a little walk and maybe a little, a little ice cream here and there. I remember that. that. Yeah, that I remember. One. I forget the name of the little town, but um, it was a it was a nice little Sunday outing that we took, and mm-hmm. so yeah. yeah, that was nice too. <laughs> so another memory we have um, is <laughs> uh, uh, is about her her love of Starbucks, <laughs> oh. the Starbucks drive through. So <laughs> um, I don't know if. Um, all of you know, but Starbucks uh, offer puppuccinos to mm-hmm. um, people with dogs mm-hmm. coming through the drive-through, and um, it's basically just whipping cream in a cup. Um, so we have some pictures. We'll see if we can find <laughs> some for you. Yeah. Maya thoroughly enjoying, enjoying her puppuccino. We uh, initially it was a little bit tricky because they would give us a small cup, which was. Normal. Very large for her. Yeah. <laughs> um, but it took us a little while, and then we we found a, a an idea where we would just ask them for the lid of a cup, and just for a dab of whipping cream yeah. in it. Yeah. So we weren't totally negligent. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, she absolutely loves going to Starbucks and, and she knows as soon as we're in the drive through she's crawling. If Peter's driving, she's crawling all over him, trying yeah. to get to the window. Let me see. Let oh, me see. She just loves the, the people at Starbucks. That, she and she's just so hi. excited yeah. and she'll be shaking and, and, and just wanting to say hi. And then, oh, I get a present. Yes. <laughs> yeah. I get a puppuccino from seen everyone and so she's uh she loves drive throughs to begin with but yes. when she receives a, a present like that I think that's pretty good but that's a highlight for her for yeah. sure yeah. yeah yeah so we we lost my she went and barked at someone who was walking outside and stuff so but um another memory is just Maya being around the home wanting to be close to her her humans and um oh pretty much you know she just lays across your lap or or lays on a pillow right next to you and just reaches out her paw and just holds you or puts her head on your leg and Mm -hmm. just uh, to be close and to um be around and yeah um, this memory is more like a multitude of memories (laughs) oh yeah (laughs) um she uh she loves to be with her humans for sure she enjoys going out on car rides. Um, yeah. She she enjoys sitting at the dining room table with us uh, if we're <laughs> playing cards or um, even after a meal, like we don't always eat at the table, but when we do eat at the table, um, she waits until everyone's done eating yeah. and then we'll, we'll come and kind of paw at someone's leg to say, hey, can I come up and socialize and visit with you too? And <laughs> See what's happening. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, for sure. Yeah. And then, yeah, she just, she's a big snuggler. Oh, totally. A big, big snuggler. So she's, she's just right here beside me, but this won't be on the video right now. So <laughs> she may change her mind. Who knows? But um, she's just, she's close. And I think that's what her, her main point is. So. She likes to be close for sure. Yeah. yeah. And our final memory. Mm. She she really gets into this one. <laughs> so our, our sixth one. She loves to open presents. Loves yes. it. And um, even if it's my present or Kelly's present or one of the She wants present, to help. <laughs> she wants to help. She's right in there, right in the business. She loves so opening, for we, sure. We try to give her a few presents at Christmas time, just easy ones where she'll just tear and rip through the wrapping paper and she'll just go through it and eventually gets to most likely a toy or um treats or, treat or whatever kind of yeah. thing so um just <laughs> very very cool to watch and she's so curious to even when i'm decorating sometimes she'll come out and she'll want to sniff of the ornaments and mm-hmm. she she just gets into the whole the whole season of it and, and yeah. whatnot so i don't know if she really thinks that well maybe it's time for christmas and she can unwrap Try to get to an ornament saying, is this mine? Is this mine? Maybe. I don't know. But um, 
Well, good memories anyway, so. Very good memories. Yeah. So we shall let you guys go and we will talk to you soon. We'll see you for our five videos till Christmas. Yes. God bless you. Bye-bye.